Good morning, people. So I'm here at Disney's Epcot. I'm gonna be hanging out with some friends later on and uh, going around the World Showcase. This is actually one of my favorite Disney parks. So I'm excited to come around and bring you guys along with me. So journey along as we go around this day here at Epcot. So I met up with my friend again, Kevin. What up, hey, what up, what he's up, from up. Jersey, he's, so. He's Jersey in the house. Jersey <laughs> yeah. in the house. <laughs> so we're about to go shopping in Mouse Gear right now and see if they have any new merch or anything. I haven't been in this store in a while, so I'm like, why not? So let's go in. Bye, how are you? Hi, welcome. Let's remember when you're inside, give you physical distance. Okay. Uh, we'll be doing that. Oh, look, they have some cool, like, Spaceship Earth Cups. <laughs> oh, look at this shirt. I like this. It's so nice. It has like all the little Mickey snacks on it. You think that's a that's a man's uh, yeah. shirt? Yeah, you, you, so? you should wear this. You definitely should wear it. I like it. All right, let, me, let me see how much it is. $59.99. Yeah, see, I, I, I don't got my glasses, so you can open it. $59.99. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they have another one over here too with like all the different parks on it. This is dope. I really like this I'd one too. This one. Is that fifty nine? Yeah, fifty nine ninety nine. Same price. That's but really I cute. If it's large, I mean, if the price goes up. So this is the food and wine festival merch they have here. Look at this new spirit jersey. This is pretty cute. It says Queen of Cuisine with mini on it, and then the front of it. That's what it looks like. They have a couple pins here too for this year. And then they have another shirt over here. It says olive, um, olive to cook and a couple cups. It's a pretty busy day out here if the line for test track stretches all the way over here. And I think it says it's about a 90 minute wait. I don't know if I want to wait that long. I do like the ride, okay. but I, I mean, do you want to wait? You know what? I'll do it later on. Yeah, maybe later, later on. But first thing in the morning, I think everybody rushes straight to this ride because it's like the first ride here in this area. But. Um, I mainly came here for like the food and the drinks. That's my 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 favorite reason why I come here. I mean, I do like the ride sometimes, but that's mo I'm a foodie, so. <laughs> and plus, I want to check out this one um, food spot because I heard it's only open on the weekends. So let's go see if it's open yet. It's called the Donut Box, which is supposed to be like right by Test Track. So let's go and find out. All right, so this is the Donut Box. Like I said, usually I think on the weekdays they're closed, but. This is what they have right here. So they have a double chocolate donut hole and chocolate drizzle, a sprinkle burst donut hole with purple drizzle, apple fritter donut hole with salted maple drizzle, a strawberry smoothie, a first magnitude brewery mark milk stout, black and white coffee cocktail, and of course water. And the donuts are about $4. Smoothie is about $5. The cocktail is about $14. And this is where it's located, right? Like literally, right, test track is right here. And the spot is right here. I end up ordering the sprinkle burst donut holes with purple drizzle. And then my friend, he got the strawberry smoothie. And this is what it looks like. Yeah. Mm. All right. Let's, let's, see, let's see what it tastes like. Yeah. All right, try your smoothie. Tell, tell them what it tastes like. Okay, so I'm trying the smoothie now. <laughs> what do you think? It tastes like strawberry quick. Have you ever had strawberry quick? For us old timers, it was, it was the powder, but now they, they use the liquid. So um, that's what it tastes like. It tastes like strawberry um, quick. Strawberry, <laughs> I want to say milkshake, but you know, it is what it is. But it tastes pretty good. All right, so now I'm going to try my uh, donut and let's see if it's, Wait, if it's good. Oh, eight. Eight. <laughs> yeah, the nine just came out actually. Oh, they're moving on behind. Yeah. <laughs> I remember right. when I got the four, and then like a week later they came out with the five, and like two weeks after that they came out with the eight. They just kept going. They're going, right? All right, so this is going to be the first bite of the donut. So. Oh, that was really sweet. I have like the filling in the inside. You want to try one? Yeah, sure. Okay. 
I can't eat that many anyways. <laughs> Double chocolate. Mm. What do you think? I really like it. I like the, um, I'm getting to the, into my food network. <laughs> yeah. The texture is really good. Um, there's a sweetness that, that really brings it out. And, um, yeah, it tastes real good. Let me stop BS. Yes. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like well, a quick snack, and I'm surprised that the line wasn't that long because, you know, on the weekends, it's usually packed well for the bride so far, but yeah. I'm surprised this line wasn't so bad. Mm. You want something sweet, you should get one of these donuts, guys. Absolutely. <laughs> now, I like the sprinkles that are, you know, that are drenched over it. <laughs> so it looks like I guess I'm not going to be doing any rides today. Literally. I have never seen it stretched all the way from here, out here, and this is the end of the line to go to Lent and Soren. Wow. Just wow. I have never seen it this busy, but like I said, I, I come here all the time, so I don't really have to do rides yeah, every time. Yeah, I once a year, so I... I but that's the different. That's out of town right here, so it's like for him, he's, he's kind of disappointed, you know? But for me, it's, it's, it's like... I, as I come here every week, I do it every week, so it's nothing new to me. I'm a local here, so I come here so often. Uh -huh. but, but that's just... I think it's pretty cool when you just see the characters just hanging out. So on this area right here, you can see Poohs. We need Poohs. They're catching a butterfly. Look, guys. How are you doing? He's going away, no! So I'm inside of the uh, China Pavilion. I didn't know this section was open. I thought it was closed. I didn't walk in. I saw people walking in. And when we first come in, it shows you about Shanghai Disney. It's just so cool. So yeah. I think this is a new attraction that they're gonna have in Tomorrowland. It's called the Jetpacks Color. Um, jet, yeah, Jetpacks. Oh, it says color model, model. but yeah. when you so look at it, look like. yeah, it looks like you're you're actually sitting side by side. And this is what their Tron look like. I can't wait till our Tron comes out here in yeah. Ma our Magic Kingdom. Yeah. I know it's already out in Shanghai Disneyland. But this is what their model of their ride looks like over there, but I'm excited for ours to come out. This is pretty cool. And this is their Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> and this is their costumes for their Pirates of the Caribbean costumes. So they're sort of their fantasy lad. Oh, that's a cool painting. Right? I think that's pretty cool. Right? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Now the thing Sorry. about it, with they call this the Enchanted Storybook Castle. If you notice that all the other Disney parks, each princess has their own castle. Yep, that is so, true. So when you look at uh, this is Shanghai. Shanghai. It's Shanghai. Yeah, Shanghai. Yeah, what the heck is that, Shanghai? That, that, yeah, that. One, that one. <laughs> But it's called the, the Enchanted Storybook Castle. So I'm, I'm assuming that probably all of the princesses resonate in this castle right here. Yeah, there you go, guys. That's a fun fact about Sh in Shanghai. And then this is their um, their uh, Peter. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? No. So that's the voyage of Crystal. Of the Crystal Gala. Yeah. Rapunzel. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. Right Peter Pan. Right there. Yeah. Oh. And then over here, it says Al's Tony, Toy Born. So Toy Story. They're Toy Story. So there's Woody and Rex. And then in this one over here, it says Remy's Pat Patissier Host Costume. What's on this one? It's a carousel. Over here is their uh, downtown Disney or Disney, uh, I think so. Wait. 
Yeah. Well, yeah, your D Disney Tone. Disney Tone. And their resorts. Stuff from the resorts. Resort hotels. The Shanghai Disney Resort. So they're. Uh, what is this? Aven Venture Isle. Oh, that's pretty cool. You see that, like, it, like a cro crocodile, I think? Oh, it's called a quark. Quark. A little hat in the room. But this is well set up on the bench. So it's funny, I always walk past this area uh -huh. and I never come in here, but look who's out here. It's Mary Poppins. So we're like waiting in this line so we can get a, a selfie with her. And this is so cool. I think this is like one of the only characters that I haven't met yet. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Absolutely, absolutely. I always watch your move, I always watch your story before I come down here and everything. So I'm coming from New Jersey, so I like that. Absolutely. I, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah, let me just, like, well, can't really see. Let me try this way right here. Sounds okay, too bright here we today, go. that's why. Yeah. <laughs> one, two, three. One, two, three. Perfect. All right, look who is here. It's June from This Life of Ours. Is that where I'm from? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, everybody? What's good? So I haven't seen him since the Food and Wine Festival, what? Two years two, ago. Two years That's ago. Two whole years ago. <laughs> it's been that long. That makes no sense. <laughs> no sense. Yeah. So where's Rachel at? She's getting food. Somewhere she's... Somewhere. Yo, this, this, Somewhere. this place is so crazy. It's like a convention center in here. Yeah, it's not super sure. crowded We're right We're doing our own thing sometimes. She's probably shopping somewhere, too. <laughs> you know her. You know how women are. Yes, <laughs> I do. And I'm glad I'm here because my, my credit card's with me. Matter of fact, I should have checked it. I should have checked it. She's disrespectful. <laughs> Wait until she sees this. Oh, yeah. She's gonna see oh, this. Oh yeah, she knows it. She knows it. Cut you knows it. Until you do right by me, you already know. She ain't right. <laughs> yeah, right. But it's all good. Now it's good seeing you. And we got our man Kesky over there. He's Somewhere hanging in the out. line. Yep. The mac and cheese line stretches all the way to almost to the front of the entrance. So what's your favorite thing here? My favorite And the thing? whole food and one. Oh, I love uh the bratwurst in Germany. Mm. And then in Japan the noodles, like the udon noodles. They're good? Yeah. I'm gonna take your word for me. Eat that thing. Or go to my country, go to China. You well, know everything good? made in China, right? But it ain't everything good in China. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay, they go to my other, go to Jamaica. They got chicken wings and fries over here? <laughs> hey, this ain't licking, this ain't finger licking. <laughs> Dude, you at the wrong place. <laughs> you gotta my, go to the west side of Orlando. My Chinese restaurant got chicken wings and fries, and that's what I always order. That's it. <laughs> hey, what do you all, well, hey, what about, what do you always say every time uh, you say? Booyaka! Yes! Booyaka! That's the same thing. Yeah, know? <laughs> yeah man. Whoa! All time for King Man preaching! Lot of mercy. Miss <laughs> Clear, Lord of mercy. Watch the now! <laughs> Okay, so I normally don't do long lines, but my friend, he wanted to go wait 95 minutes for test track and I was like, no, I'm gonna walk around and then this is the queue for Mexico right now. It wraps all the way up there where they usually do meet and greets back there and I'd rather wait in this line because it moves a lot faster and I'd rather wait in line for a drink than for a ride right now because I'm here all the time. So I was like, why not? I'm joining with my friend Paul. It's all for the tequila. Oh, yes. Hey, bienvenidos a Mexico, right? They say bienvenidos a Mexico. <laughs> See. <laughs> so in Mexico, my favorite bar here is called La Cava del Tequila, and this is their menu of all the mouth margaritas that we have. They have the pick pop, pick popcorn, La Cava avocado, pina loca, el da Diablo, Dragon's Top Shelf, Blood Orange, Black Magic, the wild one, the cucumber, and horchata. You only can get it to go, you cannot sit in this bar anymore because of course due to COVID, but it moves really quickly. The line to get in the building was really long, but it goes by really fast. And this is what the bar looks like right here. So the margarita I order is called the horchata and it has like cinnamon and like dairy in it and a little bit of tequila but I don't really like my drinks that strong so that's why I got this really sweet drink and then what did Paul, what did you get? The wild one. What's in it? Tequila, tequila, tequila. <laughs> yeah, oh. we just came here just for the tequila. <laughs> that's a mango flavor too. That's nice. <laughs> 
Yeah, because I'm although most of you guys know I'm lightweight. I cannot handle too much alcohol. And I usually don't drink anything tequila, but this doesn't really you can't taste it. It literally tastes like an ice cream or something. I don't know. It's really sweet, so <laughs> So just left Epcot and um chilling at the beach uh by the boardwalk and catching the sunset because we're about to go miniature golfing which i've never done here before so but check out this view guys it's so beautiful see the boardwalk right over there see the sun setting right over the beach and yacht club it's so relaxing little bird flying but right now we're waiting for june to come back so we can go and go play miniature golf for the very first time at least for me so this is my first time coming out here to play golf at plantation garden gardens which is like right across from the swan and dolphin and we really walked over here from epcot and it's a pretty cool golf course and you can pick whatever color you want so i picked red because it's my favorite color so we're about to see her we're about to see her golfing skills now and see what she can do Hold on. All right, let's go. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if she's gonna be to get in a hole in one. I'm hoping I'm going the right way. All right, so this is Ray. Right. Never golf before in her life. <laughs> there we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah, she's she's oh, doing her. On, she gotta on, like on. stretch out first. Oh, this, look at, this is Ed Norton. Ah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. <laughs> Norton. <laughs> oh, oh no, she didn't right, get so it. Oh. You, you want your mulligan, right? You, you need a mulligan or is that a stroke? This is golf, not baseball. She, oh, she said this is the practice round. Practice. It's a practice <laughs> round, dude. Y'all need to practice not standing in front of her. Oh. Right. oh. Okay. Did she get it? Let's see. Let's see where it comes out. Oh. There it goes. Oh. Tiger no good. Tiger yeah. no good. Where did that go? You, it's like the sand. Because the hole's right over there. Where's the hole? Yeah. The hole's right there. What oh, hole? You know what hole? Right what hole? You blind? I'm right now. I ain't telling the camera right now. What hole? You got the wrong hole. Wrong hole. Hey. <laughs> okay, here we go. So what are we good at? Just making fried rice? I'm not even. <laughs> Noodles on fried rice? I'm not even right now. Okay. Five minutes and food will be ready, right? After I'm All done right. hitting this, the food will be ready. Elizabeth. <laughs> chick, chunk, chick. Right? Elizabeth is not ready to do her right? swing. Right, let's see what Liz got. Let's see what Liz got. Oh, Jesus. All right. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Uh, okay. Exactly. You making excuses? Hey, don't get hit with the ball. Oh no. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Thank you for visiting us today. Oh. Ah. Oh. 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 Clean your hands <laughs> cover your no. mouth. And Ray, okay, so that's three. Okay. Lucky Red. <laughs> Alright, June, you gotta he, oh, what, what what is that? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Shake with your mama game. <laughs> Come on. Here it goes, it's coming out right now. There it is. It's going all the way around. Oh, that's like the price is right when you don't spin it. Oh, yeah, 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 man. Uh, I thought I was going to get stuck in this little grass right Come on, June. You can make it in the second hit. If Kevin can do it, so can you. You got to be that Tiger Woods over here. Okay. You measured it. <laughs> what in the world is that? Oh. It might go in. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. Hey! Oh! So close. <laughs> All right, so all of us got took a three tries. There you go. So today was a wonderful day at Epcot, even though it was really busy and like all the lines for the rides was really long, which I didn't mind because I didn't really care for the rides. Like, but it was cool trying those donuts at the donut box place and then having margaritas in Mexico and like grapefruit beer in Germany, which is one of my favorite beers. That's the main reason why I like going to Epcot to eat and drink around the world. And then met up with some friends, June and Rachel from this left of ours, and it was cool they invited me out to play 
miniature golf here at Fantasia Gardens, which was really cool. And you do get a discount being a pass holder. Uh, so it wasn't that bad. It was like about 12 bucks a person. It was really fun. It was, it's about 18 courses here. And like each course is cool because it tells you like a little book about what, it, what it's about. And then after you get your last hole in, they take away the ball from you. So um, it was a really fun day here. If you guys are enjoying this video, give me a thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next adventure.